Frustration for a driver in the Clear Lake area. She says raccoons are damaging her car. The critters are leaving a huge mess under the hood of her car, and now the woman wants her apartment complex to take action. Jonathan Martinez is live at the Ivy at Clear Lake with the story tonight. Jonathan. Bill, that woman tells us raccoons are a major problem here at the complex, and we talked to at least a handful of other residents who would agree with her, but more than just a nuisance, she says now it's a matter of safety, and she wants apartment management to do something about it. It's dangerous. It's unsafe. And I, I contacted the public health department. Tanya Reed calls it a parking lot problem of the wildlife variety. And this pictured paw print from under the hood of her car, she says, is proof. This is my parking spot that I'm paying for and I shouldn't have to deal with this. Reed says for the past few days, her car has fallen victim to what she believes are raccoons at the Ivy at Clear Creek apartment complex. She says while the issue started back in September, it's only gotten worse, adding her Subaru has basically become what appears to be a costly and potentially dangerous chew toy. I don't know if they're gnawing at the wires. I don't know what damage has been done to my car. You know, it's... It's upsetting. Reed even says one of her neighbors warned about the problem after having their car damaged. And that's why I started checking. So if they didn't tell me, my car would have been totally damaged and I wouldn't have known about it. According to Reed, she's contacted complex management multiple times about the matter, but has only been told they are not responsible for the damage and that they'd be looking into any possible raccoon problem. Whatever is damaging person's car, they need to you know, address it. Little comfort for Reed, who depends on her car to get to and from work daily, but is now unsure about its safety. I just want my car fixed. You know, want my car fixed and for them to notify people, do something about it. And tonight she tells us she hasn't gotten an estimate of that damage because frankly she's afraid of just how expensive it could be, although she is considering moving out. Meantime, we should mention we did reach out to the apartment management for a statement about this story, but so far they had no comment. We're reporting live tonight from the Clear Lake area. I'm Jonathan Martinez, KPRC, Channel 2 News. Thank you.